candidate for detection of synthetic insulin analogues is now validated, tested, and available for use in clinical practice. My name is Aoife Egan. I am an endocrinologist and assistant professor of medicine at Mayo Clinic. Our article is called Pitfalls in Diagnosing Hypoglycemia Due to Exogenous Insulin, Validation and Utility of an Insulin Analog Assay. It will be published in an upcoming edition of Mayo Clinic Proceedings. The workup of hypoglycemia can be challenging, particularly when it occurs outside of the context of diabetes mellitus. One well-established cause of hypoglycemia is factitious hypoglycemia. This results from surreptitious use of insulin secretagogues or insulin. Increasing use of insulin analogues in clinical practice has led to diagnostic confusion when factitious hypoglycemia is suspected. While traditional insulin immunoassays have 100% cross-reactivity with recombinant human insulin, such as regular or isophane insulin, the detection of analog insulin can be very variable depending on the immunoassay. This means that in the case of surreptitious insulin use, the insulin immunoassay could reveal an insulin concentration anywhere along a spectrum of undetectable to significantly elevated. Furthermore, even if insulin is detected, none of the immunoassays can determine the insulin subtype. In a collaborative effort between clinical and laboratory medicine, we validated a liquid chromatography, high resolution, accurate mass immunoassay to detect five of the most commonly used synthetic insulin analogs and describe its use in the diagnosis of factitious hypoglycemia. The method reported here overcomes a gap in our diagnostic pathway for hypoglycemia. The results obtained for our studies suggest that this method is appropriate for use in clinical laboratories when factitious hypoglycemia is considered as a differential diagnosis. And the test is currently available on request at Mayo Clinic. In future, we anticipate that this test will be incorporated into clinical guidelines for workup of hypoglycemia. We really hope you enjoy reading our article. We hope you found this presentation from the content of our website valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our homepage is www.mayoclinicproceedings.org. There you'll find access to information for our social media content, such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about Healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.